Hey Internet, for this video I'm going to show an iPhone app that allows you to transfer files wirelessly to your computer without using the iPhone cable. This app has one important feature that makes it a must-have for anyone who owns an iPhone. It allows large files greater than 4GB and HD videos longer than 15 minutes to be transferred from an iPhone to the computer. Files and videos that are too large can't be transferred out of the iPhone directly with a data cable because Apple enforces a file size limit on transfers. Wireless file transfers have no size limit, so you will be able to get these large files out of your phone with this app. The app is free and called Simple Transfer Wireless Photo and Video. Type that in the App Store search and download it. Okay, after the app finishes downloading, connect the iPhone to your home Wi-Fi router. This app only works if the iPhone is connected to the same router as the computer you want to transfer the files to. The iPhone is already connected to my home Wi-Fi, so I'll open the wireless file transfer app. It will tell you to type this address on your computer's browser. This is your iPhone's IP address. Open up a browser on your computer and enter the IP address. You should now have access to all the media directories on your iPhone. You can download directly to your computer from this menu. Go to All Photos. I'll transfer this large 25 minute video and a photo. If I had used the iPhone data cable, I wouldn't even see this 25 minute video file and transfer it. That's due to the file size limit in place for data cable transfers. Remember, wireless transfers have no file size limit, so we can download this on the computer. Checkmark the photo and videos you want to transfer to your computer. When ready to transfer the files, click the green download button on the right. Save the files into a directory of your choosing. While transferring files, the iPhone screen should change to say it's connected to the computer. If you are downloading a large file or many files, I suggest plugging in the charging cable because this may take a while depending on the size of the files you're transferring. I skipped the download to make the video shorter. It took about 2 minutes. Once the files are finished downloading, if there are multiple files, they will be saved in a zip format. Use an unzipping program like WinRAR or WinZip. I think most modern operating systems come with an unzipping program installed by default, so this shouldn't be an issue. And that's it. Hope you found this video useful. Thanks for watching.